for today's video. Finally, magpapa-bike fit na tayo sa one of the best bike fitters in the Philippines, which is si Sir Frederick Ilaga. Hello, Hello everyone. everyone! I do my fit, so starting with an interview. Then after the interview, we'll head on with a physical assessment. Your body is normal. You're not under hypertonosity nor hypotenosity. It means we can fully align the body. That's where I get you riding the bicycle. So we're done with the interview. What I can do as your fitter is to put you in a position where I can see is functionally correct for your body. I want to make sure that the position I'm putting into is something we both agreed after trying out several possible combinations of position. Now, yun yun nakita natin na perfectly suited for your current fitness level and your riding goal. For everything you feel, even the slightest discomfort, good, bad, please let me know. Ang uh, advice nyo para sa mga Bike Peters. Hi, wow. Okay, off the bike now. Okay, off the bike Need to go lower. Tatuli, kita ko na yung gusto ko mangyari sa'yo eh. Kailangan ko talaga magtaas sa harap. Yeah, taas sa harap. 1 cm, lower ng konti. Kasi ngayon, yung position mo, it's good. Pagkakarera ka. Okay. You're like this. But the thing, wala pa karera. Wala pa karera. So I wanna put you something relax, upright. Para enjoy, para kita mo yung kalsada, hindi ka nakaginoon. The more relax, para hindi sa sakit leg mo, hindi sa sakit balikat mo. Para naka-smile ka lang when you're riding. No point of putting you in a really aggressive position right now. Alright. Parang uneasy. Yeah. Alright, off the bike. We'll try something different. Subukan natin pareho. That's why we're here. We wanna make sure we get to try everything. Yes, that's why you buy a mice na... How does that feel? It's a pressure, but it's not the same as if it's the left or right. Yes. But I need you to tell me, let's say we're going to break the pressure in 1 to 10. 1 is comfortable and 10 is painful. How would you rate the private area? Because you know, it's very important when you talk about the private area. Because when you have discomfort, the whole ride is affected. You're not happy. You're not happy. How's that? Alright, so left. Yeah, I expected that. Para kang tiniklop. Parang, ito yung katawan mo. Imbis na ganito, nakaganong ka. Which is, it will affect the breathing. We don't want that. That looks a lot better. Yes, diba? Kanina, ipit eh. How's the private area? Alright, kuha ko yan. Pagyanan. Off the bike. Now I get it. Pwede ako mag-forward. That's the good news. How do you like it? Mas meron. So, mas comfy ka kay Power. Because of this, siguro na sana yun. Yes. Sige lang. Titigyan natin what I can do. Kung may magagawa ng parato sa Power na naghahanap ako. Nang, eto, parang hindi ka naghahanap ng posisyon. Sige lang. Ito yung hinahanap ako pa ng posisyon. Parang naghahanap ka ng force. Yes. Why? Anong problem mo dito? Meron pa rin sa gitna. Let's give this one last try. Pag wala, ibabalik sa mimic. It's not just about pedaling dynamic. What we have to consider is the private area. Kasi ang ganda nga ng pedaling dynamic mo, kung uncomfortable si private area, pag naging uncomfortable yun, lahat affected na. The whole position, your pedaling. So, mas as well, put you in a position na wala kang pakiramdam dun, then nahanapin natin kung saan gaganda yung pedaling dynamic. Okay, try this lang. Alright, goodbye. Ano, huwag tayo dyan. Ayaw ko nyan. Aangal ka dyan. Wala pang 20 minutes. Masakit na yan. Yan, na miss mo. <laughs> All right, very good. Yes, that's good news. Nah, don't worry, kasi nakatras ka. Sa the last to go forward, off the bike, lumalapat. Okay. Yung tama. Okay, sige lang, tukting lang, look forward. Off the bike. Saddle number three. Try sitting at the back. Okay, stop. Okay. Good. Sige, off the bike. Pero okay. Off the bike. Is it the one? Hopefully. Ito, yes. 
This one, yes. How does that feel better? Better. Yeah, kutingin lang. Yes, kutingin lang. You're not bouncing. Yeah, don't worry. Unstable. Off the bike. Good job. This is my job. What you need is patience. Kailangan lang ka excited na ka solve ng challenges. Yeah. And that's even lighter, ha? Huh? Pag nag-heavy ka, mawawala yan. Tuting nyo. Yes. O, kulang pa. Meron pa, no? Off the bike. May gap pa. Uy, pumapower. Growing power, oh. Huwag kang mag-alala. You're far from being a Caleb A1 category. A lot. Hindi, oh. 145 ka. Kasi kung 155 o 165. Alam mo ang tawag dito? NSP. No seat pose. How does it feel? You think you can still stretch more on the legs? Heavier. Grabe, lakas mo sumipa. Stop off the bike. Got it. Pagod ka na? That's good. Ah, perfect. Buti na lang. Try this po. The air bar's a bit forward. Yes, para ma-stretch mo yung katawan mo. Better? Ah, pwede ko siyang gawing parang gradual na uh, ano masakit parang ko, masakit dito dito po tatama in the long run Ayun, nakaangat eh, try mo mama ito matawag sa'yo ay wala pala, oo oh, nga yay, good job yay, yeah, I found it thank you comfort wise sa leeg mo how does it feel? Heavier. Heavier. Yung nga lang, this is not gonna be an Instagram position. It's more of a comfort position. Comfort position. Yeah, how do you like it compared nung mababa? Mas may power ako. Definitely. Yeah. Ah, kanina? Nung mababa? Pwede ba? Yeah, try mo lang. Weird ah. Mas may tension sa quads. Yeah, kasi bumalik sa ano eh. Kailangan ko magtaas ng saddle yan. Kasi guminong ka eh. Gumenon yung position. Unlike kanina, nakaginong ka. Ngayon, gumenon ka. Pero sa shoulder mo and neck, which is more comfortable. Yeah. Ito yung kanina. Shoulder? Mas may tension. Mas relaxed ka kanina. Yeah. Ayos ka te! <laughs> Diyan, balik tayo kanina. Dapat hindi ganun eh. No, pwede mo ibagsak. Actually, tinuturo na nga namin ibagsak ngayon eh. Para flat yung likod eh. Kasi mas aerodynamic to kaysa nakaginong ka. Kasi pag nakaginong ka, nakaginong yung leg mo. Unlike pag binagsak mo, katago. Yan. Yes. Power lang. Power lang yes. Comfort the same? Comfort okay po dito. Yes. Yes. I don't know na ito. Nere? Konte? Nagkaroon. Kanina wala ng lower. Okay, off the bike, ma'am. That's good. Parang, hello, where are you? What happened? Lebwise, no one to my left. I hit the egg pad. I saw the pad. Okay. I saw the pad. Okay, buddy. Pero power, no mawala. Pero much better no lower. Okay, git na tayo. Off the bike. Got it. Try this po. How does it feel? It's the same more power na hindi agad. Dito. This versus two mas mababa. What do you prefer? Hindi yan yung original. May spacer pa rin yan. Good. Versus yung lower one. Okay, off the bike. Which is better? Really? Power. Diba? And I like your posture here. Sustainable. 
feel faster, better off the bike. Yeah, atras yung sarang konti, hinahabol muna. Saka maglalagay ako ng pad. Good job! Oh, nice! Yun lang, kailangan lang natin magpalit. Natataas ang ka. Same pa rin. Okay, off the bike. How do you like the saddle height? Okay, na mix yung power. So, yun ako yung nagbibinis kasi yung change kit. But how about comfort? Comfort. Nandun din. Yes. That's good. Ay, buti na lang nakahanap tayo ng saddle. Yan. Very good. How does it feel? Better? O yung kanina? Everything. Everything. Shoulder okay. Sa pedaling mo. Ito yung kanina. Ah, alam ko na. Nakaganong ka. Kaya tinataas ko po itong ayon. Pero yung normal kanina ganito talaga pag pinapantay ko. Pero masakit. Yun yung tumatama. Huwag mo itabingin yung katawan mo. Okay, try this. Kasi nagkaroon ng padding. I'm, I'm checking what I need to do. Pwede lang. Off the bike. I'm gonna try moving the pads forward. Yan ba yung kanina? O hindi ba tumaas yung saddle? Medyo tumaas. Oo ko lang po. Para tumaas, no? Kasi may nalalang na lang sigit na. Okay, tumaas siya. That's the position. That's good. How does it feel? Okay lang sa elbow. Yes. And I like your posture. Honestly, pwede ako magbaba. Ayoko lang muna biglain eh. Pwede ko pa ibabayan, pwede ko islam yung stem mo. Pero, let's give it a month or two. Yes. Tignan Heavier. Look forward. Very good. Do you have any idea on how you look on the bike? Now. Pwede lang. Dapat ayaw ko pa ipakita sa ito eh. Aero bar. Watch your posture. Oh, nice. Sabi sa'yo eh, hindi ka... Kaleb Ewan. Kaleb Ewan. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna recheck you. Pati check. Yung, yung, yung pinakita, pagkakita mo pala sa akin yung... Yes, di ba bilog? And then stable. Hindi pa ako tapos sa stability mo. Okay. Position pa lang yan. <laughs> We're gonna go to the next part pa. <laughs> yes, I expected that. Stay there. I'm gonna work on your shoe. I don't know if it's big green or champagne. Pero... Sige, try mo lang. May improvement? Yes. Very good. All right, rest for a while. I'm gonna work on your body, pa. I will make you more stable, pa. A bit lang. Pero when high RPM lang. Can you, what's your average cadence when you're pedaling on the road? All right, can you try 80 to 90 RPM? Very good. Continue. All right, rest for a while. Off the bike. Remove your shoes. I need to stand over here. I'm gonna. Yes, pa. I'm gonna work on your body. Sakit, sorry. Wear your shoe, let's hop on the bike. How does that feel? Yes. Alright, stop. That's more smoother, right? Think you're faster, heavier. Big chain ring. Try that again. Looks like your foot wants to go inward. Yung paa. Yeah, yung, yung, yung setting mo kasi ngayon, nakaganon. Yung paa mo, gusto niyang dumiretso. Pag sumisipa, which is good. Okay po ma'am, titignyo. Go forward po. Very good. Sana all stable. Sana all stable. I'm gonna teach you how to shrug. Okay? Pag malakas ang hangin, go like this. Drop your body, then tago mo yung leg mo. Para ka nagtutortel, papasok mo yung leg mo. Then, forward yung shoulder. Then, like that. Then, ganun lang yung leg. Drop mo yung neck. Ayan. Titingin yung pedal. Ayan. Yung eyesight mo dito lang talaga. Titingin yung pedal. Let me see. Very good. Alright. Ayan, ganda, no? Wow. Ayan, now sensor time. Stay there lang po. 
Yay, salamat. After seven hours, seven hours man. Seven yeah. hours. Seven hours of gift? Yeah. Yeah, we started to delay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 Tagal din tayo, six hours. Last time we're done is <laughs> If nagi YouTube ka, follow mo siya. Yeah. Eloisa. Eloisa. It's a inertial measurement unit. It's a Liomo. Okay. Pero? Natural pedaling lang. Heavier. Heavier. Oh, your pedaling is very good. Heavier. Alright, kitingi lang. I'll explain, okay? So here, it's telling me the movement of your body. It's measuring inertia, not angles, okay? Ang hinahanap natin yung magkalapit, kailangan less than 10% yung difference nila. So in your case, it's almost symmetrical. But this is the most important thing. Sige, pedal lang. Tignan So forward, faster, heavier. This one, pelvic rock. Okay. So it's telling us how stable you are on the bike. So the ranges are 0, 0.0 to 10.0. So you're just playing around 2.2 lang. So it means you're very stable. Stable, yeah. Yeah, on the bicycle. Pedal lang. I'm gonna show you something else. Pedal lang. Then this is your dead spots. It's telling me kung may dead spot ka. So far, none. So it's sabihin, yung power mo, kung baga, 360 may power. Walang ampaw. Oh, okay. So hindi nasasayang yung so, pedal stroke mo. It's efficient. Medyo na correct na. Yes. And it's measuring the leg smoothness. It's okay din naman. But this is the most important You're stable on the stable. bike. Yes. Pelvic, rot Pelvic rotation. It means your hip is moving like this. We do want that. We don't want it. We need zero. The most important thing. Yeah, but... That's zero. It's not going to happen. Alright. Thank you. We're done, ma'am. Yay! Thank you very much. Thank I'm going to torque done. everything, okay? Oh Woo! Ay, wow! Okay. So I'm going to measure the bike. Na lang, and then we're good. Na. Yes, good. I'm so happy with the position. I'm so happy too. Kasi... <laughs> yeah, I, I, yun yun. Sa akin, importante, you guys are happy. Kasi pinaghirap. Hindi lang ako nahirapan. Pati kayo, nahirapan. Ganda, oh. Yeah. No? Upper body stable. Down. Yes, yun ang habol natin. And legs lang yung gumagalaw. Thank you. Thank you, sir, so, friend. Anytime, anytime po. Uh, outro pa tayo. Wait lang. Okay, <laughs> Hello everyone! <laughs> so finally, natapos na yung bike fit. Uh, ni Elsa for today. So ready na siya mag let it go. <laughs> so I'm very happy sa naging uh, bike fit ko. It uh, took us 7 hours. 7 hours. Pero masasabi ko, definitely worth it. Kasi papakita ko rin sa inyo after this video kung ano yung mga na, um, before and after. And ayun, maraming maraming salamat Sir Fred uh, for uh, you're always welcome, ma'am. May tanong na rin ako sa advice niyo para sa mga aspiring bike fitters. Siyempre, lumalaki na yung community natin sa cycling. And yung bike fitting is nagiging mas kilala na. Yes. Unlike dati. Totoo. So, ano pong mas sabi? Sa akin lang, I would always tell people who wants to get into fitting, first thing you have to do is look for the correct education get certified, uh, never stop learning. And then, when you're doing the fitting, try and try and try. Never stop trying. Huwag kayong magsasawang mag-adjust. Kasi doon sa pag-adjust nyo, doon yung makikita kung nasaan yung pinakatamang position for the client. And the most important thing, kailangan love nyo yung ginagawa nyo. Pag love nyo, hindi kayo magsasawa na uh, mag-adjust na mag-adjust sa bisikleta. And fulfilling pag nakita nyo, nakasmile yung clients yes. nyo. So, yun nga. Thank you, Sir Fred, sa pagiging passionate nyo about your work. And Thank you. So, yun. Uh, sa next episode, alam ko marami kayong mga katanungan. Kanina nagtanong ako sa stories ko kung may tanong kayo. Kasi hindi na namin na-schedule fit. So, 
Siguro sa next, uh, pag nag po after ilang days or... Um, it depends. Um, since this is a new bike, so most likely after three weeks to a month, oh, I need to see you again para alam natin if there's any adjustments that we need to do. Okay. So, i-reserve yun na yung mga katanungan nyo kay Sir Fred sa next episode natin sa so, Bike Feet after natin mag-test sa labas itong si Elsa and comment down below. So, yun. Thank you everyone. Thanks for watching this video and thank you so much, Sir Fred. Salamat din po. Bye!